Soto is in the house. Hey, hey Nikki. Nikki. Hey, guys. How are y'all doing? Doing good. Hey. Thanks so much for having me, Dad. Yeah, well, you've got some big news to talk about. I do. I'm Let's so excited. right into it. You tell me. I said, wow, that's pretty cool. Yep. We are having our very first benefit concert. And it's Black Elk, Arkansas, who's coming. The Whoa. original, the, the Black original. Elk, Arkansas. Okay. Yeah, they are really coming. They're going to be at Big Spring Park, which is where Bridge Bash is going to be held oh, on the 24th. Okay. And this will be, our event is October 1st, okay. right there at Big Spring Park. It starts at 5 o'clock. That's the weekend. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Okay. It goes from 5 to 8. Mm -hmm. um, we have tickets online. Uh, they're $15 each. And you can buy them online with your credit card or... <coughs> You can come by our offices. Uh, we're located at 1015 Highway 62 West, right next door to Italian Garden Dining Restaurant. Mm -hmm. um, you can get them at Integrity First Bank downtown. Danny Porter has them over at Century 21 Lima Realty. And we also have them at our Purple Door up to the resale shop at College and Coley. And how much are the tickets? Just $15. $15. Yeah. Good. Yeah. We're so excited. Good. Oh. Well, how did you secure that, that group? Uh, we had a wonderful guardian angel in the form of Danny Porter who helped kind of pull okay. all this together. He's okay. just been wonderful. And we've never done a concert before. It'll, it'll be interesting, but we're excited yeah. about it. Okay. We've got a lot of volunteers coming out to help. So That always takes that great. one person in the community that knows somebody that knows somebody or, mm -hmm. yep. or exactly. has a little pull or you may, they may owe them something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. It's always a, it's always a, a friend. Uh, Pay, pay the debt for somebody, maybe. Yeah. And it's good to have, make friends like that. Oh, so, very much. Yeah. Very and much. hopefully that hopefully it'll be a, a big beneficial thing for Serenity. That would be fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. That would be wonderful. And then we also have our, our uh, fourth annual walk a mile is coming up. It's okay. the very next Saturday on the 8th. Mm -hmm. um, we have our walkers checking in between 9 and 9.30 at Bomber Stadium, and then we'll get started okay. at 10 o'clock. And and were they walking just the track? Or? Just the track, okay. yep. They're going to walk four, four loops. Dan, you uh, are participating in that. I don't right. think so. Oh, oh we can't you get heels on you. I don't. Heels, heels. I knew there was a catch. <laughs> <laughs> you can bring the pumps with you, too. We you know, I tried heels on one time. I can't remember what, it was to, uh, what I was doing, but I, I couldn't walk from here to the, the monitor over there. Oh, well, you'll have other guys to help you make it all the oh, way is around. That yeah. How it's supposed oh, to be? you bet. Oh, my oh yeah. You, you have your money. Can uh -huh. somebody carry me around in a wheelbarrow? No. No. <laughs> you have to walk. Oh, my goodness. And you could also dress up. Yep, as, you sure can. Oh, what do you mean? As a woman? Uh huh. Really not interested. <laughs> Really not interested. Well, you can, you can bring one of your pups because we're having a pet costume contest first time this year. It's just ten dollars to enter your pet and uh, get them dressed up to the nines and have them walk with you. Uh, we have two big sponsors this year. Anytime Fitness is our is a big sponsor, and also all all pets at Fun Supply, mm -hmm. and they're supplying the prizes. We have uh, three prizes for the pet costume oh, contest. Man. Good. And then for the humans, we have three prizes as well. We've got highest heel which Jeff Quick oh has won in the past. Um, we have uh, Best Dressed, so your best outfit. And then we have the sassiest walk. So whoever you walks with the most oh, pass. No. <laughs> with your acting ability. We that, would, that would be in pain. That would be oh. acting of pain. We had a gentleman in a kilt who won last year. And boy, I'll tell you what, he sashayed around that track. It was awesome. Oh, <laughs> it was just okay. fantastic. But I, you know, that would be fun to watch, though. It is. It's only a dollar for spectators, Good. and and you know challenge challenge the guys in your life to do this. Mm -hmm. I think it's hysterical. Yeah, yeah. You know, tell them I'm going to pay twenty bucks. You're going to go walk. Now, this <laughs> this is for anybody to walk, but then you have a special category of just men and heels, right? Correct. Right. Okay. Yeah, and the ladies ladies can wear comfy shoes, obviously. Of course. You know, they they get to wear their sneakers. Yeah. Uh, but we want the they guys. Better than to walk a mile heel. <laughs> we yes, do it we every do. day. <laughs> But we asked the gentlemen to do this so that they literally can walk a mile in a woman's shoes mm -hmm. and can show their support for domestic violence survivors yeah. here in the Twin Lakes area. And it, it's a wonderful way, you know, several of our ladies will come and, and cheer on the guys. Mm -hmm. And it really means a lot to them that men are willing to go through this yeah. pain and agony mm -hmm. to show their support and that they care about them and that we support them as a community moving forward into healthy, independent mm -hmm. lives. And that's what Serena does. You have a you have a um, 
a thrift store? Correct. We actually have two now. Oh, okay. We have two. Um, we have the Purple Door, which is our upscale resale shop. And we're nicer clothes, business casual mm -hmm. type clothes. And that's at College and Coley, right by the uh, elementary school. And then we also have the Donation Station, which is located in College Plaza, right behind the KFC and Mountain Home. Okay. Kind of just yeah. off in that corner mm -hmm. by the Julie's mm -hmm. uh, Hallmark Shop. Well, by the yeah. Hallmark Shop. Um, that one is open uh, just Wednesdays and Saturdays uh, from 9 to 3. And whereas Purple Door is open Monday through Saturday. Nine to three during the week and nine to two on Saturdays. Okay. And are you looking for items all the time? All or? the time. Okay. Oh, always. And and what will, what will you take? What won't you take? Uh, we'll take almost everything. Um, we we use the thrift stores not only for for income for Serenity, right. but our ladies when they get job interviews. Mm -hmm. They can go to Purple Door to get at least a week's worth of clothes for their new job so that they feel confident moving into that yeah. new role. Um, we also help equip them when they get their first apartment or home with all the home items they need, you know, pots, pans, dishes, towels, sheets. We try to take that burden off their shoulders so that they can move into a ready house. They have everything they need and they don't have to worry about, oh gosh, I need to buy this, I need to buy that. They have it. And uh, you know it's 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 amazing. It's oh, we've mm -hmm. had so many success stories lately. It's just wonderful to go there and you know you know give them a little housewarming gift and and see them in their home. They know it's theirs. They worked that hard for it. They've got a job to pay for it. They've got their own bank account in their own name. And it's just it's a marvelous. And it's a new experience. start for them. Yeah. yeah Complete new start. Are there items you want to like washers and dryers and furniture? Will you take um, them? We can, can take, take them at the at the other location. Yes, at the donation yeah. station. Yep, we okay. sure can. We sure can. The Which only you couldn't thing... take before, I guess, at the, at the one location. Right, because it's so small. Yeah, yeah the donation okay. station we do have room. We can take furniture. Okay. Um, I think the only thing we don't take are just the big TVs because we just really don't have any way to move them for anybody okay. to get them to their new homes. We just and there's other places in town I think we'll take them. Oh, Humane Society will probably take it. Okay. Well, yeah. good. The event coming up with uh, Black Oak Arkansas is coming up the 20th. October 1st. October 1st, yes. October 1st. Yes. Okay. And then um, mm -hmm. at 5 p.m., thank you, at Big Springs Park in Cotter. And then uh, Walk a Mile is October 8th. Check ins between 9 and 9.30, and those guys are going to start walking at 10. So don't be late. You're not going to want to miss this. Okay. Not going to want to miss your it. cameras. <laughs> Facebook, I'm sure, here we come. I'm sure you don't need a lot of cameras there. Oh, yes. <laughs> we appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me. All right. Up next, uh, we're going to have you, right? And yes. who's going to be who's going to be with you? Ron Kern is going to be with me. And what are, what, are we, what are you going to talk about? We are talking about an event that the Eagles have done for several years for us called the Hog Rose. Oh, my gosh, food. Let's food. talk about food. We'll, we'll yeah. talk about food, food, and more food when we come back. Stay with us. Yeah.